my god. I just want to start off by saying that game was not pretty whatsoever by any means. Oh my. We had a good first half. A terrible second half. And Kyler might be injured. It's it's kind of a tough thing to go off of, but let's just break it down. In the first half, we had 10 points, 10 to 0. You know, doing pretty good. We didn't we did miss a field goal, but you know, we we had one second and Prater couldn't prepare, so yeah. Uh, but I mean, we look solid. Okay, we're holding Trey Lance down. Couldn't do anything. And then the second half hit. The Niners found their rhythm and just kept going on us. They just kept freaking shoving the rock down and throw, running to Trey Lance, which if he keeps doing that, he's going to get injured bad. So I'm not sure what they're doing over there, but yeah. And, and then, and then, if I can find the clip, I'll, I'll put it up. They literally, on a late hit, on Kyler, or injure him in his shoulder, and there wasn't even a penalty called. It it made no sense. They literally screwed us over, t- took our quarterback, hey, and I I don't even know. That game was so bad, but the penalties were even worse. We had we're decent on penalties. We're usually pretty bad, but Jesus Christ, the amount of holding penalties called on the Niners. Oh my god. Rough time to be a Niners fan. I will say though. It was not the prettiest of wins, but you know what a win is still a win. We are five and zero, but we got a lot of things to improve on if we want to go to Cleveland and win over there. I mean, Cleveland's got a decent defense, but uh, it, their offense really relies on that run. And the way our run uh, freaking defense was looking, it's not going to be good for us. So, yeah, we got a lot of things to fix, but Kyler didn't throw a pick, which is good, solid, but Kyler also didn't do too well, which is tough. He only had, if I'm not mistaken, 230. Which he was averaging, I'm pretty sure, around like 280 range. Oh no, it was a tough, it was a tough game for us. They did come to play. We just managed to come out with the win. Hey, we did end up losing Max Williams. He he uh, he broke his leg or something. I don't know. When it showed the replay, it looked bad. His leg was all crooked. But yeah, and we also lost Rodney Hudson to our center. It, the injuries are coming at us left and right, and I, I was, I'm not going to lie, I'm a little surprised we still came out with that with the win. The way we played, we just, we didn't feel like, it didn't feel like we were motivated to win that game, but you know what? We came back out there, we handled our business, and we left with the W, and I think that's what really matters the most. And, yeah. Uh, But like I said, though, we're going to have to prepare a lot if we want to go over to the Browns and beat them. So We have so many bad things, but it's just it's nice to see us come up, though, after a couple bad drives and then and hit hop for a touchdown and actually give us a chance at winning the game, in which we did. So, yeah. Nice little way to steal the game off. There's not much more I can say, so I think we're going to leave it off on there. But ho- hopefully Kyler doesn't look too injured or anything. I know it's his shoulder. He had that problem last year, and that's kind of what set us off. 
But, you know, hopefully it's all good and he can keep it together and keep us good and healthy. So, yeah. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you on the next one. Out, fourth quarter shorty, no call outs. Don't go to work, baby. Just call out uh, in the bedroom. All out perks on the counter. I can't wait to take them. Blunts on the counter. Can't wait to face it. Bad little bitch, yeah. She be my favorite. All my songs, they all on her playlist. I don't really know how to say it, but I'ma say it. I don't really know if she take it, but she can take it. I don't slow it down unless I'm in the matrix. Presidential brain, that bitch, like Sarah Palin. <laughs>